Hey everybody, my name is So Late. I'm talking about a few indie brands that I have created this look with today. But first, I'm gonna start off with the wig, just so that I don't run my fingers through my hair after I've uh, played with the eyeshadow. So this wig, I'm obsessed, like bitch. This is a beautiful color. I forget how much I paid, probably 40 bucks. I got it off Amazon. Like, you just can't go wrong with this wig. It's beautiful. And uh, I love the ombre effect. I love the fact that it's straight. It doesn't tangle as much as other uh, wigs that I have. Um, definitely check them out if you're into purple wigs or you're into synthetic wigs. This is definitely a good find, faux show. All right, so the next thing I want to talk about is the brand VE Cosmetics. I have talked about them beforehand, but this is the first time we try trying their Blood Moon palette. I use their all matte Blood Moon palette with this all duochrome palette from Pink Crush, which I've also talked about in the past before. Both, I absolutely love the brands. I continue to purchase from them. These mattes are, are just, they're high quality. Like they have a buttery formula to them. They are highly pigmented, easy to blend out. They're just a really good formula. So, uh, and then I tried their duochrome liquid eyeshadow. And uh, is that it? Yeah, I think so. I have some lipstick I haven't tried yet, but so far everything I've tried from VE Cosmetics, I've liked. So let's go ahead and do some swatches really quick. They just have a really, really good formula. And uh, like I said, it feels really good. Had no issues with it, definitely. They're out of the UK. Um, I would definitely give them a shot. I found a lot of good quality uh, brands out of the UK recently, and, um, and I am here for it. So again, this is the palette, Blood Moon. And then this palette, which I've spoken about before in the past, I'll go ahead and just bring it up again, because um, on my eyes. I am just obsessed with their formula for duochromes. There's a few companies that are the same when it comes to that wet, shiny look, and uh, they just knock it out of the park. Some companies, they just, I don't know what they're using, but they, they miss the mark. And this is one of the companies that is up there with uh, a high quality duochrome formula. Just absolutely beautiful. I have no problems with them at all. Um, let me just smear it down my finger. Yeah. It just has a very wet look to it, high shine look to it. Like I'm obsessed with this formula. It makes me just want to become one with it and and roll around with it. And if I could, I would literally become one. I would just put it all over my face. Like that's how much I love this, like this shine. Ooh, I love it. So definitely check them out. They are on Etsy. And as normal, I'll be leaving a link down below to everything that I talk about. So they will also be in that description down below. Yes, so. Next thing I want to talk about is the lipstick that I have on my lips. I talked about this the other day, but I just started wearing it recently and I'm kind of obsessed. This is from Pretty Zombie Cosmetics. This is in Black Cat. This is their black uh, lipstick and, uh, and I'm feeling it. Like, yes, I want to lick my lips, but it's not like other brands that I've tried recently where I'm constantly wanting to lick my lips. Like, it's just, it's dry, but not as drying. So the formula is, uh, is definitely good quality. I would definitely check them out if you're into matte lipsticks. Okay, so then the next thing are these lashes. I have the same lashes on that I had on the other video that I did, which is from Fire Vixen, but I have to show them again since I'm wearing them again. It is in the um, Lashes Venomous, which is the middle one right here. And uh, and I just, I love, I love this brand, that's all I can say. I definitely say check them out. I've been wearing the Morticia lashes a few times and I'm getting good wear out of them, like any other high quality lash that I have. Good high quality lashes, you can get up to like, you know, pretty much a month's worth of wear. Cheap lashes that I've tried from like Amazon, it's like after the first wear, they're like flimsy and falling apart. So these are definitely, I feel like they're, they're expensive, but they're worth the money. Like you're getting what you pay for. And, uh, and I actually purchased a few more of these. So I am fully good to go on having these for a minute and I'm excited to continue to purchase for them. So anywho, and then I think that's it. Yeah, I talked about my wig, I talked about what's on my face. And uh, this dress that I have on, I'm about to make a video. I'm gonna do a try on because I did a little haul from the company uh, Foxblood and I also bought some shoes. So stay tuned for that video. I am obsessing over this brand so far. I love mesh. I love this dress. It fits me so well. So anyhow, all right. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. I'll be making more videos in the near future and I'll see you guys next time.